Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to take a look at some new items that is actually coming out for Kamen Rider Geats, uh, which is the new, new items that that has been shown on Instagram for some reason, but I'm surprised as you guys are. Now, so some of the new items uh, that I did, uh, I did, um, I think it was a month ago, I don't remember. Some of the new stuff for Kamen Rider uh, Geats is already out now, so if you guys want to go ahead and find it but we're actually going to talk about some new stuff that is uh let's see one two three five new items that is actually coming out so before we continue on uh if you could well you guys this is the second video for camera geek so yeah make sure to go ahead and watch the last video and the full playlist of it i know there's gonna be two videos of it but don't worry more stuff is actually coming very soon for for the new series also before we continue on a lot of you guys hate the monthly toy hunt so i just want to say one thing Stop giving me the fucking dislike, because I'm giving you guys, I'm showing you guys what stuff that I find here in Texas, but you guys being an ungrateful. So, fuck you, and knock it off. Now we got that shit out of the way, let's get on with one of the stuff that is this one right here. <clears throat> so this one is the Deluxe Spider Phone. Now, this one will be releasing on October for Japan, but in the U.S. is coming out in December. So, let's see, let's see here. So, the price of it in the U.S. is $32, and for Japan, $42, so yes. Now, looking over this, this is actually pretty good. Now, this is one of those uh, uh, phone, uh, like... Phone to Beast, uh, the, it's not the first time they're doing it, I think Tom Kamara to Double did the same thing, but instead of like, you know, phones, they have like, you know, cameras and other stuff, and just by looking over this, this actually looks pretty good, and the rest of it right here, the only two buttons that actually works is the DGP button and the revised driver belt uh, logo right here, this is the only work. It transformed to a little spider, so that's actually pretty cool. It's okay, I guess. Eh, I know a lot of people are probably going to skip on this one. But this is actually not that bad, I guess. It's, it's pretty good. Of course, it's 2 and one And it has some sounds of it, so you can press the DGP, gather rounds, and other stuff. Uh, other words I can't say it in, because I don't know it in Japanese. This actually looks pretty good. And like I said, you could transform it into spider mode. It's just open up the back legs, open up the front legs, spin the head around, and boom, there you go. You got spider mode. And it is compatible with the desired driver. So then we'll say Mitch and start, and that is actually pretty cool. And here's the packaging, what it looks like, which is pretty awesome. So yeah, still available for pre-order. Next up is one of the weapons for Kamen Rider Bulfa, which is the Deluxe Zombie Breaker. A chainsaw sword, which, holy freaking shit, this is actually looks pretty good. Now, October for Japan and December for US, but for Japan it's $50 and for the US it's $40, so yes. I'm not going to lie to you, this is actually one of the coolest weapons in the Kamen Rider history, and I think for this one, this looks great. The gunmetal gray with purple, hints of black, and, and a little bit of white on it that you can see right here, which is this one. A little bit of hints of like this orange and yellow part right here, looking very good. I like the mechanical detailing of it, looks so great. So you press the trigger and it will make the chainsaw sound, and when you and when you pulled it, and you, uh, not who pulled it up, you load it up, you can see the details right there. And then we'll say poison charge. And here's the best part about this. You push it down, I'll make the standby sound, but also make the vibration on it. Oh my god, this actually looks so awesome. Press the trigger and it will set the tactical break. And yeah. Here's the back here's the packaging, what it looks like, and this is actually looking good. I think I'm gonna get this one because it's so awesome. And mostly, this is Bufa's main weapon. You can see Geats in zombie form, but also Bufa zombie form. So yeah, this is actually pretty cool. 
All right, next up we have is the is the surprise mission box 001 and the deluxe double w driver rise buckle set so this is one of those uh, carrying case one of those carrying uh carrying cases for for any henshi items for japan it's 40 dollars and the u.s 32 dollars and this is actually pretty cool there's another one which i'm going to show you off a later later uh in a moment and just by looking at it this is actually pretty cool black and yellow with the DGP logo right there and the double driver right there looking pretty awesome. And you can flip it around if so you can have like facing the right side or the left side. So that's actually pretty cool. You load it up, it will say double driver. And it will say dual on. Cyclone, Joker, and the standby sound for it. And of course the finisher, boost, double, victory. So that is pretty nice. But here's the best thing about it. You can load it in these rice buckles, those mini ones right here. If you accidentally throw away the boxes by accident. You can load it up in here. Or you can load it up the big rice buckle right here, which it is. Or the best part of it, if you accidentally throw away the box for the desired driver. You can actually use this as a storage. And these are stackable. Which is actually pretty nice. I actually love what um, Ben and Japan have ideas to design it like that. Which is actually pretty cool. But not only that, you got the Hatena Mission Box, Series Air 2, which is just a box that doesn't come with it. So this is like an extension pack for it. So $35 for Japan, by the way, which and $28 for the US. Which this is actually pretty cool. Sadly, the does, does not show the box of it. It's the same. It's the same gimmick right here, like the Mission Box. So that's actually pretty cool. And yes, these are stack stackable. So I think a lot of people are gonna buy this, the Hatena mission box, because they're probably they're gonna buy a lot of the uh, the Gashapon stuff, which I don't really talk about Gashapon stuff, but there are actually new items that is actually coming for the Gashapon stuff. This is the candy toys of it, uh, which is this one right here, which I'm actually gonna talk about it right about now. Unfortunately, the pre-order is already closed, so. So yeah, so this is the Kashapon uh, Rice Buckle Sets here one, and the one I'm actually going to talk about is the two side driver, the two two side driver Rice Buckle and the Demon Driver. And just by looking at it, this is actually looks pretty good. The white and teal looks great, and the detailing of the two side driver looks amazingly awesome right here, and the Demon Driver right there on the other hand looks pretty badass and the and the base of it is black and red and it has the shiny version of it but i don't care about that the only thing i care about is the two side driver and the damage driver so yeah so that stuff is got out of the way now it's getting on to the last part that i save up for the good part which is the revolve chain series for the figures and this one is <coughs> oh shit sorry about that and this one is the Boost Striker set. Now this is the motorcycle for Kamen Rider Geats, which they could transform into a beast. For J for US, $38, and for Japan, $46, so yes. And just right off the bat, the motorcycle mode looks amazingly well. The red, white, black, a little bit of hints like a silverish, goldish color, right? I mean the goldish color right here in the, head in the headlight with the Geats logo right there. Looks absolutely, absolutely amazing. I wish the tires, the motorcycle tires, are actually painted same thing with the rest of the motorcycle. Um, the beast, you see some of the beast kibbles showing off, which are the back legs of it right here, and the exhaust pipes looks great, which you could transform it into the, not uh, a six tail fox. Looks actually badass. But it doesn't have much for articulation, unfortunately. And like I said, they could transform. It's a 201 from the Revolve Change series. And the best part about this, it comes with the base, uh, normal base stand. Uh, the entry form of of any of the uh, any of the riders. So yeah, so you finally, so we finally got the entry form of it, which I thought to myself, we're not going to have one in the future, but now we have. It's just a plain. 
uh, basic black look of it. Doesn't have any much painting to it, so yeah. And you can, and yes, you can actually put it on the figure right here. You can see Commander Geats in boost form and with the entry form on the bottom, so yeah. So that is actually pretty cool. So overall, I think the one thing I'm mostly I want to get is the boost striker set, but I actually I also want to get the zombie striker because this is actually looks cool. It's I'll bet a lot of uh, cosplayer people want to cosplay Kamen Rider Bufa and have the zombie breaker. I think the one I'm gonna get is the boost striker set, and then pretty much that's it. But what do you guys think? Which one you guys gonna get? And for the new stuff, it's actually coming out for October for Kamen Rider Geats. So yeah. Anyways, you guys, I'm gonna end this right here. So have fun, stay safe, and I'm always. I'm out.